In this video, I will explain about the extension that you need to know about who wrote the code. So, for example, in this file, you can see that just above this line, it is saying you 23 hours ago, one author. So, what it means is that one author or the developer has made the changes 23 hours ago. And here is the name of the developer. So, right now it is saying you, that means I have made these changes. But if there is another person that had made those changes, it would show the name of that particular person. So this information is actually coming here because I have installed one extension and that extension is called as git lens. So just before I go to that git lens extension, let me show that. So if you take your mouse just above this line, what happens is that you can take a mouse over that line and then it will show you the exact details like the person name, the time at which this change was made, the commit message and the hash code of that particular commit as well. So if you want to see this particular information, you need to install that extension and that extension is git lens as you can see. This is the extension that you need to install. It is called as git lens. It is very popular extension and once you install this extension, what happens is that in the source control, you will see extra menus so by default there is just source control but after the installation of the git lens you will see commits menu then there is a repositories file history branches remotes stashes tags work trees search and compare all these options are available because of git lens thanks for watching